Hi children today we are going to study about the most beautiful and colorful creatures in the world any guess let me give some more clues for you all yes they live with us and they give signs of rain or shine or earthquake or storm they are the sing singers they wake up as early in the morning and few of them talk to us even they teach us how to live and how to live together have you found out you are right they are feathered creatures called birds and you know the famous proverbs uh, telling about this birds no early bird catches the worms and birds are same for this flock together and another information the great scientist right brothers and dr apj abdul kalam they too got inspiration from these feathered creatures only yes you know very well right brothers they invented aeroplane after seeing the birds flying and dr apj abdul kalam got interest in space science after watching the birds in the sea show let's go to the lesson now first to the general features of birds the birds they have got wings most of them can fly only few cannot fly example ostrich penguin kiwi they are flightless birds and they have got light and hollow bones all birds have got hollow bones and they have got feet with claws we have got nail in our te- in our fingers and toes no similarly birds have got claws and they have got beak they do not have teeth they have beak to tear bite chisel crush or chew the food birds have streamlined body or boat shaped body with the help of which they fly in the air and if you see their body their body is covered with feathers there are three types of feathers down feathers flight feathers and tail feathers down feathers keep their body warm flight feathers help them in flight tail feathers help in changing the direction okay do you know which is a wingless bird kiwi is a wingless bird wingless as well as it is a flightless bird and let's see in detail about their beaks sparrow and pigeon they have got strong short hard beak to eat nuts and seeds then eagle and vulture they got, they have got piercing and tearing beak their beaks are hard and hooked to tear the flesh flesh bobbing beak sunbird and hummingbird they have got long slender pointed beak to suck nectar and parrot has got curved beak to crack the nuts and other uh, some birds special they have got special beaks flamingo flamingo has got shallow keeled bills in bills is the other name of beaks to eat insects and fish then spoon bill is a bird is a bird which has got a spoon like bill to eat fish and s- snails pelican is the bird which has got a pouch like beak to drain the mud and uh, waste while swallowing the food and swallow has a sticky beak beak while flying it catches the insects so the insects um, will be caught through this uh, sticky beak then let's see in detail about the feet now actually here um, all birds have got uh, four toes only uh, 
and the arrangement of toes are different in birds let's see the different types of uh, feet first based upon the types of being uh, feet there are different types of birds here first one scratching birds example hen it, uh, the hen has got three toes in front and one at the back with strong claws or talons we can say uh, to scratch the ground in search of seeds and insects in the soil so this type of feet is called travels feet because they help the they use the feet to dig the soil travels feet uh, then next to perching birds example sparrow they have got four bendable toes three facing forward and one facing backward with a uh, long slender claws they are uh, they have got claws which are very slender that means thin and they with the help of these toes they perch on the trees they hold the branch of the tree wading birds example uh, storks herons and cranes they walk on the shallow waters and mud uh, they have got long slender legs with uh, spread out toes so that they can easily wade on the shallow waters the next swimming birds uh, examples are ducks and penguins they have got webbed feet to swim in water webbed feet means all the toes are joined by a membrane so with the help of this webbed feet they can swim in water and they are good swimmers but <coughs> slow walkers i hope we have covered all the important points about the birds and some general questions let me dear children here are the riddles for you you have to find out the bird name and identify its picture from the picture bank okay riddles and you have to find out the bird name identify the picture from the picture bank the picture bank is given at last after the question is over from the picture bank you have to identify the correct picture also okay the first riddle is the smallest flying bird which can fly backwards that will hum like bees second one the fastest running bird and it is the biggest bird and which lays the biggest egg too what is that bird third one there is a fruit in its name it is the wingless and flightless bird and it is the national bird of new zealand what is it fourth one there is a country in its name its name ends with key k e y key what is it fifth one the clue picture is here who is he and find the bird sixth one the clue picture is here find out who is he and find the bird seventh one this bird has a pouch in its beak what is this bird eighth one this is the bird of peace and innocence what is this bird ninth one the bird which stands for power and positivity it is called bird of prey what is it tenth one this bird is called carpenter bird what is it eleventh one this bird is found in arctic region and its name starts with what you used to write its name starts with what you used to write find out that bird twelfth one this bird won't build its nest 
it lays its eggs in crow's nest only but it's a good singer who is it 13th one it has bright plumage that is plumage means feathers and it eats fish only and it has got uh, fish in its name too what is it 14th one it's a dancer with a fan of feathers it's a national bird also what is it 15th one which is the fastest flying bird 16th one it is known for its intelligence it is a regular visitor of, of our home its other name is raven r a v e n raven okay can you find it hope you can get the pictures from the picture bank also okay at last let me give the answers also separately thank you my dear children